much. How can military medics best train for mass casualty events? The answer could be next generation virtual reality operational medical training. This is SimX's VR medical simulation system. It was designed to overcome the problem of training medics to deal with scenarios that can't always be captured in traditional simulations. Valor was actually developed in partnership with the US Air Force and other components of the US military. Um, the idea being that they were aware of this VR technology being used for civilian and healthcare workers. And during the pandemic um, in the United States and around the world, military forces were being deployed to support overwhelmed civilian uh, personnel at medical institutions and they realized we need to train people on these new techniques very quickly. How can we do that? Well, maybe we can use VR. Oh yeah, you went up to 100%. 100% yeah, you are. The technology was on show at ITAC, the training technology exhibition in Rotterdam. The RAF is apparently in discussions about trialing this system for its medical personnel. It's getting real hard to breathe. <laughs> It's argued there are many advantages, including being psychologically immersed in the event. You know, physical mannequins can be very expensive. They require you to be there physically at the mannequin. Um, and when these mannequins cost $500,000 or more, um, it can be very difficult to get them to the point of need. And of course, clinical training, though very valuable in the military context, you have to detach forces from their military job and send them to civilian hospitals to be able to train, which is you know, very expensive, very time consuming. Um, nevertheless, you know, the most highly trained medical forces across a wide variety of militaries, militaries, that's what they do today. And so our hope with Simex is that instead of having to go somewhere to do your training or to go find a mannequin to do your training, anywhere you can just put on a headset and be immersed in a battlefield environment and practice your skills the same way you would in real life. Virtual reality medical training could be the closest thing yet to reality, but in a safe environment. Claire Sadler, Forces News, Rotterdam. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.